And now, your first alert five weather. Check it out, not a cloud in that sky anywhere. 51 is the current temperature, very light breeze. It's variable right now at just five miles per hour here on News 5. New snow on top of Greenhorn Mountain looks spectacular this morning. 58 degrees is the current temperature. It's a little breezy in some neighborhoods out at the airport easterly right now at 15 miles per hour. That system yesterday did bring some moisture to parts of the News 5 viewing area. Just a taste in Colorado Springs at 300s. Pueblo picked up a little over tenth of an inch of moisture and in Fountain big winter that's real good rain there all the way from uh, Fountain to Hanover all the way out to Truckton 28 hundredths of an inch of water in the Fountain area here's what's going on now it is clear and it is dry take a look at that not a cloud to be found anywhere across the home state right now and here's what happens around here tomorrow big ridge of high pressure really the key player for our state that'll bring in lots of sunshine and tomorrow you get temperatures even warmer than what we had out there today that high pressure just scre uh, squeezing all the available moisture out of the atmosphere. Hour by hour, if you're out early tomorrow morning, 30s and 40s at 9 a.m., warming into the 50s by 11 o'clock tomorrow morning. And even as we work into the afternoon, you can see uh, that product of high pressure just, again, squeezing all the at um, atmospheric moisture out. So it's going to be sunny and warm temperatures into the mid 60s by mid afternoon tomorrow. And even at sunset tomorrow evening, we'll have mostly clear skies. Next shot of any significant moisture holds off until Tuesday, and this is going to fall mainly over the northern and central mountains. But I think they could see some pretty good snow. The main track with that system going to be too far north to bring anything here to southeastern Colorado. Look at these updated temperatures here on News 5 at 4. We've got 50s and 60s across much of southeastern Colorado, 40s up high. Overnight low temperatures tonight on the cold side, 25 in Pueblo, 27 in Colorado Springs. You can see just about everyone below freezing tonight. And with that in mind, a freeze warning active from midnight until 9 a.m. So cover your plants and cover yourself as well. Highs tomorrow making a nice jump into the 60s here in southeastern Colorado. Very little wind to worry about tomorrow. Maybe a light breeze during the afternoon, 5 to possibly 10 miles per hour. It's going to be a great weekend, even warmer on Sunday. Blue skies, sunshine again. Wind ramps up on Monday with a system across the area. What that'll do is increase fire danger here across the Pikes Peak region. Be cognizant of that if you uh, go about your plans on Monday. That system is going to blow in cooler air by Tuesday. Not much cooler, though. We're down to 61 degrees by Monday and then starting to warm up again Thursday and Friday. Pueblo, that 13 hundredths of an inch of water you got yesterday is going to have to hold you for the next seven days. Dry skies. You will see blue Colorado sky each and every one of those days. Really couldn't order a nicer weekend for this time of the year. Sunday, sunshine in 76. You'll want to get out and stretch your legs before the Bronco game. Windy, warmer on Monday. That'll be your warmest day over the next seven days. That system rolls in some cooler air Tuesday and Wednesday, but nothing dramatically cool. Canyon City, you're also going to be dry for the next week. Real nice weekend. Monday, windy and warm, and then temperatures fall back into the 60s by the middle part of next week with sunshine each of those days. And for Woodland Park, it's going to be a mild weekend, especially on Sunday. Windy, warm, increasing fire danger on Monday, and then temperatures settle into a nice pattern even Tuesday through Friday with highs into the 50s.